Hello, this is Din75 Games. Welcome back to another Let's Play of Crusader Kings 2. I am King Frederick the Confessor, age 49, King of Germany, King of Middle Francia, and King of Frisia. It is the year 1067. And, well, we just remarried in the last video. And I did it just for, because we lost uh, a domain size and a vassal limit with my, my last wife that died. And she's okay, she's German. Genius. I, I mean, no bad trades. Really good diplomacy. Yeah, there's nothing I can say that's bad about her. Von... House Von Brauwiller. I don't know what that is. Obviously, it's, she's not an Adelard. Uh, my previous wife was getting old. I'm kind of getting up there. 49. She's 16, so she just came of age. I don't know. Um, her opinion of me, it's all good. Too bad I can't seduce her. My wife now. Uh, it's kind of this seduction thing has done nothing. Like literally. Well, I shouldn't say that. I got that maid. Is it scullery maid, maid servant lover. Yeah. And yeah, I went to seduce her to get her opinion of me higher. And she's old. She's like in her seventies, but nothing came of it. So it's almost. It's like <laughs> what the hell. It shouldn't do that. It should come up and say something's happened, at least, or try to seduce her. My son Theodoric does not do... Does his homework and is always on time for his lessons. He has a good mentor. He's gained diligent. So it's now 1068. And in a year, we'll be able to go to war again. We had their vassal levy limits really high at one point. The highest one was like 47 or something. Which is pretty bad, if you, unless you want your kingdom to fall apart. But it's gone down. Uh, it's gone down like 20 in all places. So we are still waiting for a whole year. 1069. I don't suppose that the uh, these guys can come back from their defeat and, and win. I would love to take them on. But I don't want to have to ra you know, gain the ire of my vassals by going down there again. Very is starting to look smaller. It really is. It's been a thorn in our bottom. It, they were good allies for a while. But this is rightfully German territory, so... Oh yeah, yeah, so I've said... I still... We still haven't gotten rid of this guy. Bar, yeah, we still have our guys there. Send gift. 70 to raise it up by 51. Well, he's probably gonna be out of the faction then. Let's see. Interesting ideas on how to improve the economy. Adopt his ideas. Economy spread rate 100%. I don't know for how long. Um, okay, so Fifth Byzantine War is over, but now we're our side is losing down here against the Umayyads. Hey, we had a big risks. Uh, white piece. Okay, so do I? I don't really want to do a. What do you call that thing? You know what I'm talking about. Hold Grand Tournament. I don't really want to do that right now because everybody seems to be okay with me. So Church, let's go with Castle Infrastructure, four. That should open up new things for us, actually. We should training ground. Um, well, since we have so much money, everything's coming by really fast. So, militia training ground, 80 light infantry, 10 archers. Size of our personal levies from our domain is pretty large, 4,522. Bar has been a success. Now, this guy is, should be over 100. There's no way he can be in the faction anymore. Yeah, he's done. Okay, so let's get this guy to fabricate a claim over here in Nuremberg. And you can go study technology down in Rome. If you're very religious, then you probably really like that posting. Okay, so let's go after these guys here. Local knowledge, maze. All these local knowledges have in Greece. Uh, never been a shortage of troops, that's fine. I think maybe you should be Stuart. Uh, no, not Sir, a Marshal. Let's see. Uh, research military tech up in Gottingen. Chasing after these Vikings now. Should be a slaughter. It's taking a sweet time. It's middle. 
Middle of the saves, at least. Not It's just past middle of the year. It's July 4th. Always saves. July 4th and um, January 4th. Well, we beat them. They're still there, though. Yeah, no, they're not. They're done. Okay, who'd we lose? Oh, my Marshal. Okay. This guy's good. Alderic. Maybe this is the guy that I just kind of brought on. Uh, research military check. Put him up in Goddington. Okay, yeah, the domain size, it shouldn't have gone down because this guy is 20. I don't know. He should be higher than the last Marshal. It's gone down like 400, 500 soldiers. Weird. I would have liked to see my personal levies for my domains reach up to 5,000. Fabricate and clean up middle Frankia. Yeah, I don't think so. And plot. He ended the plot. And it's been like three years and still nothing. I wish she would just die. Can I kill her then? It's crazy, but it's screwing up my seduction. There's no, no point in it. It's not even 50%. That you can get for maximum. Okay, just waiting. I think um, my guy's 50. Yeah. So, when his next focus is 1070. Okay, so I'm not sure what's going on with Lithuania up here. Now we're just kind of sitting back, wasting time, is what we're doing. Game time is burning. It's almost 1069. Uh, still, these guys won't be completely gone. How is there a Baron in there? Weird. <coughs> Baron Wolf of St. Omer. He must be... Is he independent? And there's a Mayor Ludwig of Roth as well. These guys shouldn't be... Oh, um... Roth if it's in my domains, yeah, but... The Barony of St. Omer, that's up here. That's not in my territory. That's up here. If I can go... Can I go transfer vassalage? There, Barony of St. Omer. Will this take it down? Let's see. It did not. Did not. Bishop Herman of Fulda. I, I don't know where that is. All these places. Okay, so, January. I guess we can go to war with Bavaria, then. Let's just make sure they don't have any big allies that could have anything. Countess of Osterich. No. Oh, we may have to wait. Uh, I'm sure there could be a truce, declare war. Claim Bavaria. Oh, one of these things again. Unless it's my guy. I'd love to do that in one go. Unless it's one of my guy. My spy master is Duke of Upper Burgundy. I have to look at this guy. Uh, Duke Ernst the Usurper. Duchy of Upper Burgundy. Uh, but where? Is that here? This guy. But what would that give him, though? Okay, so we we take all of... I don't know if I, uh, I like that, though. Let's see. Uh, if we win the war, King, he lose... Duke Ernst usurper against the Duchy of Bavaria. I, I get is that the Duchy of Bavaria? It's the Duchy of Bavaria, not Kingdom of Bavaria. It's a Duchy. Wow, that's one, two, th that's four, four counties in one go. That's a lot better. Your claim on Grissoms. It goes to the same guy. He's my spy master. I don't know. I mean, I guess so. We can take four places. Let's see. Are, is... Are they at war? I, I don't think so. No. I guess they settled the war between Bavir uh, Lombardy 
and themselves. They're not at war with anyone. I would love to be able to claim it. Uh, my kinsman, Spymaster of Breda, Count of Breda, Prince of Bavaria. My kinsman. Where's Breda? It's important to know this because I can get everything in one go. He would not. Yeah, even if he is. He's Prince of Bavaria. It wouldn't do anything because he doesn't have any claims or doesn't have any titles within my land. I can't just give it to him. He's not within my kingdom. I guess we'll go for the four county thing then. The claim Bavaria. Duchy Bavaria. Let's go for it. It's going to be hopefully not a nasty war, but raise up everything. Oh, jeez. Wurzburg. Now, let's go over here. Let's grab everything. Go to Wurzburg. Uh, as for this, that should be everything. I don't know how much we raised. No, oh, 17k of 17k. So everything has been raised. We're going to have around 23,000 soldiers. Oh, I didn't get this one. I don't think that's a good idea. I could, I could go like this. Get him out. I don't know if the AI will go after it. But Lords of Bavaria have approved medium crown authority law, but that's Bavaria. I'm not sure why I got that information. This should be a good war. I fear my son Theodoric is too cynical for his age. Uh, nothing Strap won't care. Nope. Only religious fanatics in this family. Yeah, this is going to be a nice war. It's going to really carve them up. I mean, these they're going to lose these, this, or they'll lose that. Oh, uh, I saw this five counties, actually. It's including this one. I didn't see that. So we've taken five counties in one go, I and mean, it's much better than just the one county each time. This guy is, if we... I don't know if we're going to win, but I'm pretty sure. This, this guy is not really doing anything, then. What I could do... Where's their capital? I, oh, it's right here. What the hell? Brussago. Could go like that. Fabricate a claim there. It's not on our list of places to grab, or is it? I don't think so. I don't know. It kind of looks like it. It's flashing. Flashing orange. Maybe it's, it is one of them, but I don't know. Oh, Baron of Meeson. Okay, so we need to get rid of that. Grant landed title. So we built the Bishopric. Still waiting for all the soldiers to come up. It does take a while. It can take like six or more months if you have a large realm and a lot of soldiers to bring in. Six long months, and obviously we. Well, I think that attrition is going to be a little bit better because we're not the fourth. One? I don't know why I always forget. Military Organization 4. It has increased global supply limit by like 12.5%. Hmm. Uh, I don't even know where to go first. Nuremberg is on the list. Uh, but what is it looking like? 18k. We can't... Well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to split this in half. And you go there. The better led army can go here. Um, I'm just going to see. I'm going to try to lure them out. There may be like 15,000. There were about 15,000 last time I went to war with them. So, go sit on Nuremberg. They'll send their army up. We'll see what they have. And then, I mean, it's going to be around 12,000 each army. Close to it. And then, uh, once we see what we're dealing with, if it's a large army that comes to up to Nuremberg, they... I mean, by all rights, I shouldn't have that. They just were at war. I didn't even see 5,000 soldiers against Lombardy. I could go to Kempton. Let's see. 12k. Well, once it gets... Uh, now I can't really tell what's 
This one, this one, this one, this one. And this one. So we can go to Bresaga, but it's far, far away. If, if another army comes up, they could, you know, divide and conquer the armies. That's what brought the Byzantines down against uh, the Turks. Dividing their army because they thought that they could easily win a victory. Well, I don't see anything. And the AI should have news. Uh, the Clement Mattel's Gunda, Gunda Old is hiring meant for attack against it. Oh dear, I hope he's not prone to accidents. Okay, so what is this? Adventure threats. Where is this guy? He's in Trento Trent. Is that not Lombardy? Uh, let's see. I didn't see what the plot power. No, it's nothing that special. 56% is the highest. Let's go to Bresigo. I don't think that they're going to be able to put up a fight. We'll go after the territories that are on the list. I do believe you get better war score that way. No, no armies at all. And, oh, oh, okay. So we see one army. It, It is not even as large as one of our armies. But that will change, though, with attrition. I would like to take that on. No, it's a bad time of the year to try doing that. Please tell me what's the attrition. 13. This may drop low. That's not a good spot to be in. 18k. This is 18k. Uh, what's this? 22k. I'm gonna leave because I don't want to be there in January and it drops to like 8k. We're fine now, but... Sit down for good old fashion sieging peasant revolts on Santoy. That's over here. So we'll deal with that. Deal with the peasant revolt, and then turn back. Could also go for, for their capital too, because yeah, see, it dropped to 13k. We're, if we stayed in Bresca 11.2, it was it's not too bad. We would have been 600 soldiers too much. I'll keep the money, keep it going, uh, just in case I need to hire a mercenaries. And uh, by the war's end, if I don't need to, I'll just buy a new, uh, construct a new holding. Go after one of the places with like one that just has one holding. I think we, we have one of us, Old Oldenburg, or here? No. Nope. Cell. Yeah, we'll, go, we'll build a new place in Cell. Get the enemy in Santoy. Followed up, only lost a few hundred soldiers. This is where the retinue really is, too. This is the better led army. Yeah, we did suffer attrition. I, I I don't feel comfortable having the army separated for too long. Come on, deal with these idiots. Just surrender. You have no hope. Okay, let's let's put them over an ohm. Go up here and then down to ohm. So it's side by side. Okay, so we should have, let's see, prisoner. I uh, don't know who he is. Vanish. Just execute them both off of their heads. Still don't even have one place. We're close to it. Siege of Nuremberg. Yeah, it'd be great to have Nuremberg as an addition to our empire. That was the original capital of the Holy Roman Empire, is Nuremberg. So we've taken that. Taken a woman we could um, ransom. Nope. Release them. I could stick them in Kempton. I guess. I don't know. Uh, oh, for crying out loud. Why another peasant revolt? Where, where, where? This one's small. I don't feel comfortable leaving these this army here. See, if they hired a mercenary group or two, they would be able to outnumber us. And this is not as strong. It's not as well led and doesn't have the retinue with all the... Like, they have uh, over a thousand heavy cavalry in this. 
It's like our attack army. But they're not doing anything, so... And we'll just keep on taking their holdings then. Target my seduction has tragically passed away. Well, they're playing more fish in the sea. Crying out loud, that took like five years, and now I can change my focus. Right? Yes, I can. What a joke. That's stupid. I wouldn't even know who to... See, what I would like, if it was actually working, if I could seduce my future wife and then marry her, I think that's cool. Let's destroy this... Come on. July 4th save. Um, okay. Oh, not imprisoned by me. Oh, we have a faction up. Destroy the enemy in bar. Alright, now. They're done. Let's go to Ulm. This time, no more... Revolts, please. Banish. No. Um, execute them. Not in any mood. You rebel against me, you're going to be executed. Okay, it's just working on the, the shop work right here. They can go to Kempton afterwards. We're at 19% victory. Yeah, it just takes so long for this army to get anywhere. Move! The speed, too, of the game. Okay, sitting right across the river from the, <laughs> their army. What I can do is, like, wait for the weather for the right season, like, say, spring, say, like, April, and then combine both armies and go after them. Not across one of the big rivers, that would be crazy. But, you know, really not any place. I mean, the size of our army has gotten to the point, you know, I mean, and 12k for attrition there. Really not much. Okay, Nuremberg has been ta completely taken. Go across the river. What are they doing? They're arriving in Ulm. They're going here? Are you, are you serious? Okay. When are they going to be there? December 17th? Uh, December 24th. Will they keep coming? No. Then we'll just let them come. If they start coming once, they should start coming again. I don't know. Anyways, I should uh, end the video here. My son is screaming upstairs, crying out loud. S seventh month old, but he's really only five because he was born six weeks early, so... Five months development, that's what the pediatrician says you have to go by for measuring age and growth and development and all that stuff. All right, Kempton. So now they're going across there, and we're going to have to confront them. I don't think they're going to win. This is a, a our best-led army, and it's got over a 1,000 heavy cavalry. I think what they're doing is crazy. So what I'll do, it's going to tie me up more because I'm, I have to cross the river to do it, but I'll bring them across the river again, January 24th, so... Let's just see how long it'll take. Uh, 24th. Well, if we go now, we can meet them, but I don't want to do that. Anyhow, uh, thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time.